Yo, what's up, guys? Today, we show you guys how to earn as much Robux as possible from Please Donate. Some of you guys struggle to earn 10,000, 1,000 Robux. Today, I'm gonna be hopefully changing that. If this video does help, do be sure to hit the like button and subscribe. I'm gonna be giving you the most useful tips I've ever given so far. Just a heads up that everything I say in this video is extremely useful information. But anyways, let's just get right into it. Actually, the first thing I want to say is change how you bet. Some of you guys, if you saw me in a game of Please Donate, would probably just go up to me and be like, OMG, OMG, so Alex, please, please, please donate, please, please, please donate. I just want to say off the bat, that does not work. I'm gonna show you an example in a private server what doesn't work. Presumably, these people are gonna recognize me. See, this guy's already done. He said, please donate me. You have one mil. Like, making someone feel like they're forced into doing it. Like, oh my god, you have so much Robux. You might as well share it with me. That is not something that's going to get you a donation. I'm going to tell you that off the bat. Because if someone came up to me like, oh, you have a million Robux. You should donate like 10k to me at least. And I would definitely not donate to that. Now, it looks like no one in this server is using what I would probably donate to. So, I'm just going to say off the bat. Nobody in this server has got something that I would donate to. Easy Robux. Go 500. AFK to 100. Need Robux for Game Pass. So, this is why diving into the first point. You guys need to change what's on your stand. If something isn't working for you, it's definitely just ineffective. There's something that says like, oh, if you donate, I donate. Sub to all. Okay, <laughs> these guys see that I'm in the server, but like, 10 Robux equals 1 push 25 goes to donations. Too many people have this kind of standard. This just doesn't work. But here are three main things you can change your stand to. Let me quickly open a private service. People stop following me. So the three main things you want to change your stand to is firstly giving a reason for people to donate you. The best reasons tend to be because you're a donator. Now, I know for a lot of you guys, this isn't possible or you just don't want to do it. And I'll give you some options if you don't want to change your stand to like about how you donate and stuff. The people who have earned a lot, like 100,000 Robux, have generally also donated a lot. Having 500 raised and 1,000 Robux donated is like the easiest 500 Robux of your life because people will be like, oh my god, you only have, oh, oh my god, you only have 500 Robux. A lot of people, maybe it's just me, but I know a lot of people probably would pop your stand if you're, and they'd be like, oh my god, you have only 500 Robux raised, we have 1,000 Robux donated. Oh my god, I'm donating. Oh my god, I'm donating. Don also, having a diamond or dark matter booth, so the 100k or the 10k booth, these are really eye catching and could probably work really well to get people's attention, like attract your stand. I personally like the diamond one. I know 10,000 Robux is a lot, but I know a lot of you guys can still do it. Having this stand can just help you tremendously. Also, ignore my stand right here. I'll change it to something that probably works better. Now, if you do not want to donate to people, the next thing you probably want to do is is provide some sort of value in the slightest. So this time, people can hover over a button and see an image. That's your chance to do whatever you want. Now, obviously, if you're using a shirt that doesn't work, but if you have a game pass, you're uploading a game pass, obviously, you need to go to passes right here. And then you go hit choose file. Or you can upload any image on your PC. And that image will appear every time someone hovers over your button. Obviously, I just have some like random arrows and like <laughs> pictures right here. But you, you, but you can make that anything you want. You can make it an actual shirt. You can do something funny or interesting. Like, I don't know, pretend to sell KFC or something. So you can just be creative with that. Anyways, moving on, the third of three things you can probably put on your stand and there's a third of three options right here is to beg or encourage people to come to your stand now when i say begging i mean begging in the correct way not the way i showed you earlier in this video that a bunch of people did but instead maybe encouraging people to come to your stand not like yo you should check out my stand because that's like sort of directly doing it you should like maybe make, make a reference to your stand every now and again especially if you're like you know especially if you're in like an active server and you're having a conversation with people but the three options i've just given you right there which is being a donator doing something interesting or sort of begging i definitely don't recommend begging but the first two are actually quite good so yeah, instead of your stand you could just put a goal but instead of putting a goal that's like i don't know instead of putting that as your stand it's getting censored but something like this works better obviously don't lie that you're going to be like funding a game or something there are much better ways to earn robux if you're not trying to fund a game but this does work for serious developers who are struggling to get our initial funds and it's moving on a very good tip i have for you is entering giveaways i know a lot of people say this but it's true and there are so many small discord servers which have giveaways running all the time this could be for only 100 or 200 robux i say only but that is a good amount of robux to be getting for free and only 20 or 30 people will be entering those giveaways so it's almost like free robux for you because you have such a high chance of winning i'll link some bigger discord servers that do giveaways down below in the description before we go check that out though i have some even better tips for you guys before i move on to those tips i'm gonna quickly move on to my nitro giveaways channel all right so i just started 3000 robux giveaway for my boosters right here and i currently have a giveaway running which is ending in an hour as of recording this video by the time you're watching this is probably going to be a new giveaway so join my discord server down below for that and if this video gets a thousand likes in the first hour i'll make it a 20,000 robux giveaway all right now my next tip for you is using rich text or like fonts this sort of sound probably works way better rich text can combined with a nice stand is like the key to getting donations if you guys are wondering how to use rich text i have a tutorial on the top right of your screen right now click the little info card and you can find out how to use rich text it's pretty straightforward though I think if I was a rich developer and I saw my stand, I'd probably donate to me just because of this message right here. Cause it's kind of similar to BVOJ's, and it's the reason why he's earned so much. I'm sure, you can say he's a YouTuber, but that is also a very large part to it. Anyway, some other good tips that are going to be very useful is going to be firstly, if you're feeling your servers a bit inactive and boring, go ahead and switch servers. This isn't encouraging rich hunting because I don't like that. If your server's feeling a little bit dry, just go ahead and join a new one, and then you might be able to get some more donations. You know, being in a server where there's no donation going on, everyone's AFK, it will give you no use. Another tip I have for you is checking out some small streams because there's so many please donate live streams where people actually go ahead and donate. Sometimes it's 
hard to find people, but sometimes there are people who are streaming with like 10 viewers who are donating to all those 10 viewers. So if you're one of those 10 viewers, it's like easy Robux for you. My final tip, guys, is that AFK sometimes does work. If you're on an AFK overnight, feel free to, because that does work for a lot of people. Some people earn like a thousand Robux overnight, as long as you have like a good thing on your stand. So being active and responding to your donations, so like thanking people, just like this person right here. There's gonna be something big that'll actually help you earn a lot more Robux than if you're just AFK. Anyways, if this video did give you any value, do be sure to hit the like button and subscribe. And thank you all for watching.